The Backrooms killed me, literally and mentally. Most of you know what The Backrooms is, and a good chunk of you have probably already seen gameplay of Escape the Backrooms. It's a fun, single-player or multiplayer experience that everyone can enjoy. Unless you're me. You see, this game has multiple difficulties. Normal is normal with checkpoints, hard makes entities harder, and you have to restart the level you're on when you die, and then there's Nightmare. Nightmare makes your sanity drop way faster, forcing you to move quickly, but it also makes it so that if you die, you go back to the beginning of the entire game. That means if you're three hours into a run, about to beat the game, and you die, poof, all your progress is gone and you start over. After trying to beat this difficulty for over six separate streams, I had enough. I decided to do one final stream, the finale, to see if I could beat Nightmare Mode, and if I didn't, I would not be coming back to this game for a long, long time. Anyway, enjoy watching what it looks like when someone has played Nightmare Escape the Backrooms for over 26 hours and has their skin stolen from them. Just a little recap about the levels that are going to give me issues. It's just a couple, right? So, a minor level is going to be the library with the attractive grandpa. Y'all named him that, not me. That's what y'all named him. So there's the library, and I think the next one is the cave, with the cave skip, but I pretty much got that down pat. So we're good with that, we're good with the cave skip. So then past the cave skip is <laughs> the bone thief level. The bone thief- oh wait, no, right, dark suburbs. Uh, yeah, the wretch houses- as long as those houses spawn in the areas where I can easily glitch them with the computers, then I'll be fine. If not, then that might end up being the hardest level. But, if we get past that, then the next one is the Bone Thief level. And I just have to be careful and not panic like I did the very first time I tried doing that. Okay. So there's the Dark Suburbs, the Bone Thief. After Bone Thief is the, like, dark pool rooms area, extended pool rooms. But, as long as I do the Flare Gun glitch, that ain't gonna be a problem. Then there's Party Room Plus, where we died last time. I am going to take my sweet ass time on that one level where we died. I'm going to go so slow because I know I have a lot of sanity items in that level. I'm gonna go so slow it's gonna look like stream is frozen. But then after that is the final level. The final level is the only one we've not practiced or gotten to. Whew, and that's gonna be fun. Huh. Well, we've gotten one key so far, which means that either all three of them are in that one room in the very back, or I'm as blind as a bat and dumb. One key, two key, can we go for a third? Uh, it, it was a third in this room, damn. Blood's doing the crip walk, oh shit, he saw me, never mind. Dang, I can't even joke with the monsters right now. They're all just on my ass, because they know I'm gonna win this time, and I will never ever have to deal with their stupid, ugly looking asses again. Did I hear about the Haley Welch's new breakthrough? Who is Haley Welch's? Isn't Haley Wel Welch's the name of the Hawk Tua girl? Pretty sure I'm wrong about that. I just I just don't know. Okay, elevator is on the third level. Of course, blood is going to the elevator where I have to go. Oh, he went away. The fuck? I, I don't know his pattern. He is such a weird, like, AI path. Sorry for your ears. I gotta say, this is probably my least favorite part of the whole thing. Like, typing in the code here, like, back there with the three pole digit, what, whatever it's called, I just don't like it because it's just complete RNG for uh, having to put in the correct one on the correct column, and there's, like, no pattern to it, so sometimes it'll take a whole last minute, sometimes it'll literally line up perfectly and take you two seconds. All right, time for Smiley McSmilers over here. Hopefully they don't screw me over. Listen, this is the first run, so I've got beginner's luck. I take that back. I'm not doing that shit. That was about to murder my ass. Hey, it's right here. Okay, good, good, good. Hey, great time. Actually, that's god awful time right now. <laughs> Three to four hour stream. Listen, I'm gonna do my best to get this done first try because I do not need a repeat of yesterday when the stream went on for seven and a half hours, even though at like the four hour mark, I said it was time to end it. And then, you know, ooh, somebody made a bet and I lost that fucking bet. All right, time for, uh, time for electrical dogs is gonna be 
My favorite part of the game, it's so funny. Oh yeah, Backrooms does kind of give Fran French catacombs, the Paris catacombs vibes. The French catacombs are so cool, you love the history. Okay, they're the Paris catacombs. But no, you're absolutely right. Those things are both amazing and absolutely terrifying at the exact same time. Because it's like, it's just, you know what the labyrinth is in uh, Greek mythology? Like that whole maze with the bull and the minotaur and King Midas and whatever. So, it's like that, but just real life. Would I ever go down there? Absolutely not. I would piss my pants and cry in a corner and curl up into a ball. But is, are the photos cool? Yeah. Got any tips of being a YouTuber and staying consistent? Yeah, it's gonna be a really bad tip because I'm not, I'm not a good teacher by any stretch of the means. Essentially, you just have to not pay attention to your videos. So when you make a video, like, pay attention- why is that door locked? All right, well, I missed one. So for example, like pay attention to what the comments say, like uh, what you could do better and actually take the advice on that. But on the other hand, don't like pay attention to the analytics of it. Don't get depressed if you got only a couple views for your first couple videos. Believe me, it really is depressing. Just look at your videos, watch them, look at tutorials, figure out what you can do better and then slowly over time get better if you do not learn or you do not fail and you just believe you're always successful and you don't need to change you're not gonna you're, you're never gonna like advance you're just not it's not how life works that's not how youtube works god you're so loud what like you can't even call these dogs and i even think hound wouldn't even be the correct term for them like, what are you? What could you possibly be? It's the dog version of the hairless cats. Whatever that name of that cat is, that's that's what this dog is. All right, the green goes with the green, and the red, and the red, and the green, and the green, and the green, and the green, and the red with the red. Learning my colors as a kid really comes in handy. We're not making good time so far, but I am still a little tired. I'm a little eepy from waking up earlier. Stayed up until about 5 a.m. making jambalaya. Dude, this jambalaya I made, I've never made it before. After I tasted it, after I fully made it and put all the Cajun seasoning and red pepper flakes on that, whew, that's probably the best jambalaya that I've ever tasted in my life. I'm telling you, and I, I will brag about this, I'm a damn good cook. Except when it comes to burgers. I, I just, I can't get it down for whatever reason. Anything else, though, I'm like a god at. Alright, Meg Room again. Gonna have to use this eventually. It's a surprise tool we'll use for later. Time to perform some math. Let's do the math real quick. How many tables? One, two, three, four, five. There are five meth tables. How many meth coolers? One, two, three meth coolers. One, two, three, four meth chairs. And one, two, three, four, five meth cookbooks. And that apparently opens the door. Look, like I said before, um, once I get to the library level, that's when my energy levels are gonna shoot up because like right now I've practiced these levels so many times that it's just like, I could do it with my eyes closed. So I'm not really paying attention to any of them. Bug spray. I guess that's the one thing in this game that I'm never gonna get used to is the fact that you can just spray bugs with bug spray and then you eat them. That's a, uh, that's uh, bleh, bleh, bleh. We must sacrifice the moths to the gods in return for their keys to eternal greatness. Oh, moth gods, give me a key to your eternal heaven, and I will do your bidding for all eternity. As long as you don't kill anybody, I think it's technically legal to sacrifice bugs. I just don't know, like, there's a limit. Oh, wait, shit, right, uh, uh codes, 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 codes for hotel, please. One, five, nine, three, and eight, please be it. Hell yeah. Okay, which means we can go over here, drink this almond water to restore our sanity, and then we're done with hotel level. When I first started doing Nightmare, I did that level legitly, and it took me like 10, 15 minutes, and it just sucked so badly. You beat that level in 10 seconds, though that's where you got stuck and couldn't beat it for like, dude, the bug level, this one I'm on, when I first did it, this was probably the hardest level, man. Just because, like, I could not for the life of me remember the correct pathway. And I also didn't understand the fact that crouching prevents the bugs from coming after you. I thought you just had to book it and hope for the best. Alright, bug level done. Bug out of the way. No more bug. On the level fun. Dude, I seriously can't get over the fact that YouTube introduced, like, ads over live chat. 
it's just so annoying, man. There comes a point where you just gotta say, okay, maybe we should just start sacrificing some money in order for the experience on the platform to be better. Because holy crap, man, it is. It was... <laughs> Fun rooms part one, hell yeah. You day, you day. Fasten your meat belts, we're going to eat ceilings. Okay, soda time. Shit, shit! Well, there goes the beginner's luck. Well, it was it was a slow run anyways, you know, it was it was a it was a slow run, you know? We'll be back to where we were in no time. A few minutes later. Listen man, if you don't if you don't want oh shit, I'm probably dead. So far the stream is going absolutely terribly, man. Many, many minutes later. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. A late, my brother knows about the nightmare costume. Me and him went to go see the FNAF movie together and I wore it to the FNAF movie. Still, that's one of the best times I've ever had as well. Going to see the movie and then literally had to take about probably 100 photos, close to that. And then security had to, I had to ask them to eventually escort me out because my brother had to go to work and I literally couldn't get out of there. I do grease. Seriously though, like 10k, like I ge genuinely, like I knew eventually I might have hit 10k. Did I think it was going to be this year? No. I think this year, <laughs> I think I told myself at the beginning of the year, try and get to about 5k. So basically I doubled my goal. TPX poop. What what great commentary TPX. I love that you had to add that to chat. It really it really just it just adds so much conversation or value to the conversation. Woo! Here we go, here we go, here we go. Time to lock in, and then after this is the library. Lock in time. Library time. Just get through this as quickly as humanly fucking possible. Do not want to be here when it's nighttime or when the lights go out. Why are you in this area? The area, the area that I gotta go through. Shit. Got all of them. Go away. Get the fuck away from me. Get the fuck away from me. Get out of here, attractive grandpa. You should go away, buddy. You're not attractive to me. And attractive grandpa is gonna disappear into the void. Bye, buddy. Are you gonna float up into the ceiling? Yep, alright. <laughs> he went into the back rooms. What are you talking about? A late you lusting crate. Okay, we're not too happy that I just saw what you're talking about. I'm gonna try and do the, like the speed runway that they go up here. Which is like, it's really weird because like you have to be super precise or else you just mess it up. Wait, yeah, I can't even do it. Oh shit, oh, we already got the level 94 and we're only at 14 levels up. That's like the best I've ever gotten so far. Shit, no, go. I gotta be as fast as possible if I'm gonna beat the Milkman level easily. You're craving some guy gravy TPX soon, man. Soon you'll get your guy gravy. It'll be towards the end, but you'll get it. Drink this one and then go in here. Get back in and then we're good. They should have called this one Grassland. No, it's the Milkman level. It's never called Grassland. It is Milkman. It is Milkman. You get a shit ton of almond milk and this is a milk van. Milkman level. Okay, we're almost at here. Now we get off. Milk, 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 milk. What the fuck? Why did I just get teleported out of the milk van? That's not very demure of you. That's not very mindful. All right, when are those clouds gonna start moving? Cause I feel like it's gotta be real soon. Like now, it should start doing it now. Yep, called it. Get in here, turn off the lights, hide under the bed. What do you mean standing on the fence or not? Oh, are you talking about standing on the fence and then you spin around in a circle and you launch your friend across the map? I don't think they fixed it. It's getting darker, gotta wait for it to get a little bit brighter. And it's brighter, all right. Time to go to castle. Go to clown, and then go to the dark room level, then go to the ocean level, 
And then we're at Cave Skip, and that's gonna be fucking fun. Man, I'm tired. Ugh. That would have been a good place for, like, a sponsorship, you know? Like, man, I'm tired. Good thing I drink, insert name brand, coffee. The only coffee that keeps me awake during streams. Listen, man, any coffee company want to sponsor me? I guarantee you I'll make a whole... Okay, I'll make a whole video. It'd be so great. You'll get so much exposure, totally. You'll get so many new customers. Get all the kids addicted to drinking the coffee. All of them. Start them young. Start them while they're young and impressionable. Garage sale baby shoes never worn. I don't want to know what happened to the baby. Hello, clown. Just uh, don't mind me for a moment. I gotta go over here so that way I can glitch you out. Okay, get up here and then... Onto the umbrella. Can't die up here. Where are you at, clown? Like, there's no way he can spawn on the umbrella, right? Because he can't move if I'm up here. But there's no way he spawns here, right? Hey, uh, buddy. What's up? Sorry you had the GTA walk in place because I broke your whole system. It is clown in time, not the fruit punch clown. God forbid I ever have to deal with that again. Oop, it's ready. On the roller coaster ride. What the fuck? I'm not even holding on to anything in my left hand, apparently. I got that invisible ghost grip. Almond water and almond water. All right, let's go. The clown probably has no Y search value, which is why he stays in place because the Y value's off. Maybe alpha? Also wretch, ooh, spooky. But yeah, I guess that makes sense. If you're too high up, he just can't get you. All right, light our level time. This is gonna be fun. Hold up that map. Because there's no way in hell I'm ever gonna remember this. That monster, go away, buddy. Okay, right here. Just keep going right till we get to the two rooms and then I know where I'm at. Okay, there's one room. I think we're almost at the two rooms. Okay, yeah, we're at the two rooms. Okay, good. Which means right here, which means we need to go left. Okay, left, down, left, down, right, and then right again, and then we should be on the correct path. Cause like, this should be the right area, right? This should lead us to the door. Hell yeah. Woo. All right, drop the LiDAR. Go ahead and drink an almond water and it will be good. Ocean level time, let's go get the flare gun. Speaking of the flare gun, uh, I found out something really damn cool today. So apparently with the flare gun in multiplayer, if you time it just right, you can rocket ride the flare and you can use it to skip so much stuff in this game. That is probably the coolest thing you could possibly do in this game, but I will never be able to do it because I'm doing fucking single player nightmare mode. If there was a way you could self-rocket ride, which it's impossible because the flare is like a grenade, you can't bounce it off of anything, it'll just explode. But if there was a way, man, ooh, that would be so cool. Alright, get the flare gun, and then, uh, get the hell on out of here. Flare gun doesn't affect my boat, right? I'm tempted to shoot it, but I'll do that after I get to a safe point. I don't feel like shooting it now and then having to swim all the way to the lighthouse. The coolest thing is to be able to blow each other up with the dynamite sticks and fun plus. That was very, very fun when me and my brother did it. Like, holy crap. We spent like 30 minutes on that one, like, sub-level just trying to get past it. But we would keep blowing each other up because we couldn't resist. And then it was literally just the moment we would respawn. We would race to the tables with the fireworks. And then whoever could, like, time it perfectly to get it off where it would blow up under them. Speaking of my brother, for whatever reason, he's typing in a symbol language right now, and I'm very confused, concerned, all of the above. Anyway, uh, so do you actually affect my boat? Holy shit, it does. <laughs> Bye boat, have a good trip. It's time to go 47 meters under. That's the name of the movie, right? 47 meters under, 44 meters down, something like that? I don't know. Follow the light, follow the light. All right, Unreal Animation 5, whatever, pull cutscene. All right, all right, all right, time for cave skip. This is gonna be so, so, so fun. Just gotta remember, take my time, don't rush it, line it up perfectly, because if you don't, I either get soft locked or I have to do a whole bunch of weird bullshit to get back to where I was planning on going in the first place. These cave sounds, man. Super, super chill, calm, ambient, relaxing. I love it, man. All right, go ahead and drink this, grab a flashlight, and then cave skip. 
All right, all right, all right. Cave skip time. Woo. Oh, I messed it up. Woo. Cave skip. Oh, I messed it up. Okay, it's right here. Boom. 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 Now jump up here. Oh, 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 oh. Wait. Wait. Hell yeah, there we go. Cave skip time. Speaking of caves, uh, just the other week, or probably not other week, but a couple weeks ago, I guess now, uh, I went with a couple of my buddies because it was his birthday, and he wanted to go explore a cave, so I'm like, eh, sure, why not? It's your birthday. Whatever. So we went exploring a cave. First time I've ever been in, like, a real cave, that thing was terrifying. Because, like, if we didn't have our phone flashlights, it would have been pitch black. There was bats and pigeons in there, and it was also just turning night, so we had to hurry up and get our asses out of there, or else we were gonna be stuck there and lost and confused. Okay, line this up, take your time, and be careful, because if I fall right, I get softlocked, and I'm not going through that bullshit again. Hey, hey. Hey, hey, what's up? I made it. Okay, but that was the easy part of the cave skip. Now I gotta do the hard part. Now, I don't remember exactly which way to go. Not right there. Don't go right there. Oh, no, I can fall right there, so I have to jump. Okay. Oh, shit. Get up here. Get up here. No, 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 no. We're not doing the same bullshit we did last time. Get up here. Oh, God. No, we're fucking... Ah. Well, we're doing the same thing we did last time. Hopefully, we don't fall into the damn void. All right, so I think we fall here... Or not. Oh shit, sanity. Normally there's a box here somewhere. Oh, it's right here. Okay. So I'm falling the box. Alright. Go he go here. Alright. This is the one part I hate really badly. Okay, never mind, we did it. Alright, it's fine. And now we did it. Whew. That was the easy, relaxing, totally relaxing cave skip. Now it's time for the best level in the entire game, the totally best level, the funnest level, the fun fun level. Not the fun level, but the fun level. Time for wretch houses, and I'm going to go ahead and go get the staircase that goes to the meg room. Holy shit, I'm almost out of sanity, okay. In which case, go back to level 4 again to get that almond water. I need to find some juices to drink to restore it back to full. And then I can move on. Okay, we can we can drop flashlight here for a juice, maybe? Going back, see if there's another almond water, but I'll take the juice if need be. Just juice. Alright, here we go. Ooh, one of the hard levels, one of the hard levels. Ooh, okay, we're good. No, 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 we're fine. I'm not worried at all. I'm not, not worried. Alright, let's go. Okay, we got one here, one here in that corner. So one right there, there. Going to this one over here. Alright, well, I don't think there's any way to glitch this guy out, so I'm just gonna have to deal with it. See, you see me, right? Yeah, you see me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on outside the house. Come outside the house. Okay, he's outside this door. I have to be real careful with this computer because this one sucks. Come on. Okay, what's this next one? Okay, I know how to glitch into one of these houses. I don't know about the other, though. I don't think there's a wretch in one of these. Okay, is there a wretch in this house? It's not even this house. Okay, this house right here. Drink an almond. Pick this one up, and then we'll be good. <sighs> all right, all right. Two down. One more to go. Then we go in the basement, cure the guy, and then we can get out of here. Okay, okay, okay. Go, go, go. The last one is in this house right here, and I can glitch this one, I'm pretty sure. No, I, this is the one I can't fucking glitch. You gotta be kidding me. Well, this is about to be interesting. Hi, buddy. Okay, you're in the doorway now. Fine by me. Are you glitched? No, you're not glitched. You're not glitched. Okay. He got out. Okay. No, no, go, go, go. Oh, fuck it. I'm circling all the way around. I do not give two shits. Okay, go back in the house. Close the door, and then we're good. All right, get this final computer. Layla the butter dog. The dog with the butter. Butter dog. Dog with the butter. Dog with the butter. Butter dog. He's right there. Fucking go! Okay, he didn't even see me. I'm good. Alright. Meg house. The big old mansion. It's capitalism in this neighborhood. You got the big old Meg house that's super clean, super nice and tidy, super big. And then you got the other houses that are run down to shit. Alright, let's go cure a mother trucker. 
Why are you always slightly open? I don't understand. In the event of an accidental contamination, extract the emergency platform on top of the footprints. I wish I could crowbar you. Oh, are we done? Can I go now? Make sure we don't run into this guy. I'm pretty sure he stops on the exact opposite side, so I can go in here quickly. Okay, so one should be in here. Yep, all right. And then the other one should be in this little area in the vent. Go back, put the almond extract in, and then we're good. It's almonding time. Boom. 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 Uh, hold on. I gotta put the next one in my hand. I gotta... Boom. Alright, there we go. Now let's go, uh, let's get him in here. Hi, buddy. Please, step right up to the pressure plate. It's okay. Listen, the process won't hurt a bit, and it's only gonna take a moment, alright? Just try and remain calm, and don't scream. That wasn't so bad, was it? Thank you. Please come again. Simple dark suburb level. Simple, simple. All right. Uh, access code. Let me vote. Oh, I thought it denied it for a moment. I was about to say. Grab a flashlight and let's go. I'm trying to save all my commentary for whenever I get to Bone Thief. Because Bone Thief's gonna suck. Since when was Huggy Wuggy brain rot? Okay, the game itself, Poppy Playtime isn't. But the fact that people make videos and turn it into brain rot, that, that's the actual brain rot part. It sucks, man. The world we've come to. Just one day, about a decade or two ago, somebody made salad fingers, and then everybody's like, man, maybe if I make it just a little bit more, uh, a little bit more dark and weird and psychedelic, I'll get a little bit more views. And now we have a uh, skippy toilet. All right, which way are you going? Oh, okay. All right, then, I mean, if you want to go that way, you can. I don't... Okay. You know what, he, he's got his own methods for dealing with stuff, you know. Maybe he doesn't want to chase me. Maybe his whole motto is just, you know, scare tactic. All right, arcade time. Woo! And then Bone Thief. Not looking forward to that. All right, go get the Meg Room real quick. I have no reason to get this one, but I'm just doing it anyways. All right, nine, three, one. All right, gotta lock in, gotta lock in, Hello. gotta lock in. Well okay, make sure Sanity's fine. All right, all right, all right. All right, okay, where's the monster at? I'd like to not do any, how fast does sanity go down? Sanity goes down at a weird amount. Gotta find that monster, man. Okay, monster's over there, so don't, don't, don't go that way. So if I can get this one over here, loop around and get that and those over there, I think I'll be fine. All right. Monster doesn't see me, okay, go, go. Two. Get one more and then exit. Exit. <sighs> fuck it, fuck it, holy shit. I, 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 I really, I should not have fucking gone for that third one. That was way too risky. I've, you know that feeling when they say you got like a frog in your throat? You know, I've never really felt that before. But I, I'm feeling it right now. It literally feels like there's something right here preventing me from speaking. What's the hardest level, Caleb? Either this one, level fun plus, or the final one. Okay, good. I got that one. I, I need to do the bone thief skip one more time, but I'd like to only do it one more time. Because there was one locked over there. There's going to be one locked over here. And I just got to get those. Okay, we're back here. Which way are you gonna go? If you go, okay, you went left. Please fall, please fall, fall. Thank you, okay, good, good, good. This one. Okay, get the fuck out of here, get the fuck out of here. Hmm, <sighs> okay. This is just gonna give me a heart attack, isn't it? I don't, I don't even care if I had no chance of running into the monster there. Just, my body is just, like, convulsing right now. And not in, not in the good kind of convulsing way. In, in the kind of, I feel like I'm about to, like, l have my whole soul sucked out of my body from a demon. And not the good kind of demon. So it should be all. Okay.
That was a glitch. That was a glitch. We all saw that, right? That was a glitch. I flick it. You see me flick it. The thing is fucking going down. No, you don't have to wait for the gate to fully close. I can guarantee you that thing does not have to fully close. I'm gonna go virtually the exact same speed that I did last time. So now let's wait half a second. Apparently, you can go too fast even though you close the door. That makes zero sense. Now I gotta do it again. All over again. Two hours later. Alright, y'all. Gotta lock Hello. in. I just want y'all to know that feeling that I just got, like the 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 the, re the release of dopamine. Whatever just happened inside my body when I won won that level, it wasn't a good feeling. All I felt was dread, and I don't know why. But I'm happy I made it. Don't get me wrong. I'm just uh, I'm just I'm still tweaking. St st still 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 tweaking. So on this first one, when I open it up, I go right, avoid the doors, go into that blue hallway. That's the one hallway you go into, you get the chainsaw. You go down, turn around. Do not go right on the first one, you go right after the staircase. Here we go. Okay, turn around. Don't go right on the first one, go right after the staircase. Let's fucking go. Go right after the staircase. Don't follow the blue light. I don't know what it is. I don't feel good even after beating this. I don't feel good. All I feel is just dread. We made it through. It's time for TV level. Let's just get the meg room first before going on. I'm playing it safe. I'm about to be the most like pr overprotective type thing ever. I'm also going to say this. If at any point this game crashes or it does a glitch that's not supposed to happen, I'm regaining the save file and I'm starting back from here. The TV's not in here. Shit, he spawned! Oh, hi there. Get one TV and then do the glitch. Were you talking about the running thing? Where I glitch through the exit door? What are you talking about? Sprint with the TV through the door, turn 45 degrees left, press SD and F on the TV while walking. That sounds like some weird game combo. Okay, Sawyer, two things. One, if you want me to do that glitch, you I need a guarantee that there's no chance I die. You won't die unless I run out of sanity. In that case, type again exactly what I'm supposed to do here. Sprint the TV into the door. Oh, shit. Okay, it's all the way through. What do I do? Let go and then turn 45 degrees? I'm, I've turned 45 degrees. Like, this is like 45 degrees right here. I'm gonna hold S and D. And press F like as late as you can. Oh shit, I got it to work. Okay, do I fall? Do I just fall? Fall? Alright. Is the monster gonna spawn? Oh, he does spawn. Hi, buddy. Bye, buddy. 
Thank you for the love of God, Sawyer. Great, now time to do this level. This is going to be so fun. All right, let's see if I can get this raft glitch to work like it did yesterday. Odds are it won't, but still try my best to get it. This is the third last major level. Then there's Fun Plus, which is the second last major. Then there's a little in-between level. And then it's the final level. I just got to get really lucky with my shot. Okay, um, so let's try and do this. Almost. So let's get back here and try that again. Well, I about lost the raft. Shit. Anyway, three, two, one. Shit. We're gonna get this. I got this once, I will get it again. 15 minutes later. Yes, no, let me in the raft. Oh, I got through, I got through, I got through. Holy shit, okay. Okay, well, I, uh, raft is stuck. So, raft is gone. All right, we got that done, which means as long as I don't die from the algae here, I will be fine. Is there any possible way to save the raft? Saved it. All right, at least we can go over this algae so I don't have to deal with it. Cause I remember this one gave me some problems. Now, what exactly did I do here? Because we perfectly- Oh, yeah, right, we had the frame skip here. Turn a V-Sync off and frame rate to 30. It might look weird for- Oh, God. Okay, yeah, this looks like hell. I didn't even- Ah, uh, I did it too early. That's my bad. Raft is not floating. Huh. Go! Oh! Please! Urgh. Can I get stuck under the raft? Oh shit, maybe? Alright, we good. Whew, okay. Last part. We left the raft behind, but it got us through a lot. Just go up here, turn the thing, and then I can jump over, and then I'm Gucci. What are you waiting for? Run, just kidding, run, just kidding. Please make sure to sleep with fat her ankles in her throat. You date- oh shit. And also, if we ever want to have any hope of beating this, I have to allow that. Also, let's go. Who's ready for fun day plus? So when we get to this level that I, uh, miraculously died on last time, I am going to lock in and be the most careful son of a bitch you've ever met. You day time, let's go. Your special day is tomorrow. Why aren't you here? There's nothing to be scared of besides for you. Read for the bugs. You day, it's you day. And thus your knuckles or toenails, whatever works. What are you waiting for? Run, just kidding, run, just kidding. Please make sure to sleep without her ankles in your throat. Such a good song, man. I go feral for it. That is the easiest one done. Okay, we're going blue one now. Okay, it's firework level, we're fine. Imagine playing a U-Day instrumental at a birthday party. I would love that. Think I hit it? Once today, you day, it's you day. Building skin sometimes twice, filler words, fungus, rice, birthday cake, fourth wall break. What? You miss today, who's in the throat? Hi, buddies. Song is fire, man, I'm telling you. What? Two day? Oh shit. <laughs> I was trying to get into it more, but right. I think that's about as far as I need to get into it. One of these two is the one I died on. I'm gonna go on this one first, but they're both pretty much equally hard depending on how I go about it. So which hard one are you? <sighs> this is the one I died on last time. I'm going to go so safely 
that basically if I do not know ex his exact location while I'm moving, I'm not going. Ankles in your throat. No, 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 I don't know why the fuck you went after me. Why? You were going the other way. See, this is what I'm fucking talking about. He literally turns around the moment I start to... Taste your bladder, craving some guy gravy moist in your calendar. It's today, going to eat ceilings, you day. You day, and use your mucus cause you'll wish your name was Christopher. Your own you day, it's your friend. Wait for him to come back, figure out where he goes. Go the opposite way. What? Thank fuck. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Wait for him. Go the opposite direction he goes. He went that way, right? Okay, he's coming this way. Where is the last one? Shit. Go, go, get the fuck out of here, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Give me that damn key. Holy shit. One more party pulse level, one more party pulse level. Be careful, be careful, be crouched, be crouched. There's one over there. I don't remember exactly the balloon's order. I just know that somewhere back here, it's possible for it to spawn. Come on. Grab the key. Please go away, please go away, please go away, please go away. Get the fuck out of here, get the fuck out of here, you potato sack looking Pennywise rip off ass. Shit, we beat Party Plus. We beat fucking Party Plus. This is now officially the farthest we've ever made it. Holy crap. You do not know what kind of pressure and just overall dread I am feeling in my body right now if I lose. There it is. Doors open. Guy gravy. Okay, do I grab juices or no? Let's repair real quick, alright? Repair. Fucking shut. Music, shut up. Do I... Grab a couple juices, sacrifice what sanity the almond water could give me, but get a couple more juices than I would normally have for the final level when I go against the monsters, the smilers, and the weird thing from level zero. Okay, well, let's just, let's go in here first. Let's get the meg door. So that's all the meg doors, by the way. We got all the meg doors, so 100% escape the back rooms. Ooh, ooh. Go to level four, go to the hotel, and get jelly. How much jelly? Would three be good? We're gonna go get three moth jelly. We're gonna go back, do that level before the final one, and then see see what happens. Gonna be perfectly honest, this is it. This is the final attempt. I don't have the energy to do another full three hour attempt after this one if I fail. I just can't. I just can't do it. I'm gonna get four, because four is two chances per level. So, I'm gonna get four, just so I can have that almond water. Because part of me is gonna wait. If you do this final level, then I've successfully escaped the back rooms. Yeah, I really would've. This is one. It takes five minutes and 30 seconds to die of sanity in 55.1, so the final level. So, I'm guessing that's from full to, like, you lose all your sanity. So, knowing that, if two almond waters gives you full sanity, and I carry one, two, three, four, five, six, seven almond waters... Are we going to say about 15 minutes? 
roughly 15 minutes to uh, to beat the final level. Because on that final one, if I run out, if I run out on that final one, I have to risk it. I, there's no choice. Okay, back in the office area. Where the hell's the exit? Oh, it's right here. This is it. Final level, final level. I got... There's nothing else I can do to prepare. This is it. And let's go. Just be extraordinarily careful here. I'm gonna crouch so far behind you. Hi, guys. You have tormented me so much. I hope you burn in the pits of hell. I hope you burn in hell as well, potato sack, Pennywise, knockoff ass. Your poor buddy over here got molested by that dude. Three hour mark. I just realized that. I need the adrenaline to stop. I need the adrenaline to stop. I feel fucking spikes the closer I get. This is it. I lose sanity here, so there's no time to waste. This is it. Let's do this. I'm actually gonna drink a, uh, a juice, right? Actually, no, fuck. Energy bar. Eat an energy bar right before picking up the camera. On to the second level. I don't think I can see it from here. Don't see the monster any. chest hurts dude i do need a truck picture first Fuck. there's a truck Fucking photo. <sighs> oh, my fucking God. We're going to go up and get the the, the stuff to refresh me with more almond water. I don't know if I can fucking do this. I'm genuinely, like, I don't know if my hand is steady enough to keep me steady. God, that's fucking beautiful. Okay. There are two more photos left. They're on the third level. I need to get tiki heads, but there's also smilers there. Final trip down. What direction? He's over there. What fucking direction is the Tiki heads? Okay, he's right there. So if I were to go, now would be the perfect time. No, he's going that way. He's going that way. Go back. He was heading in that direction. I didn't realize how close that direction was to where it... Take it! <sighs> 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 
Final one. Final one. Please, for the love of God, monster, please come over here. Please. Please. I can't go after you, buddy. Go! Go! <laughs> Please, let me out of this fucking hell hole. I, I can't. Please, for the love of God, let me out of here. I'm gonna try hold my mouse for a moment. Do y'all see this? If I'm not putting enough pressure to hold the mouse in place, this is essentially what it's like right now. I don't know how well y'all can tell, but like, I can't. I have never been more happy to see the end of a level or the end of a game than right now. Oh my God. My throat is like dying. I don't even know what to say. Three hours, 16 minutes, and 20 fucking seconds. Did my headphones turn off? They did. Huh. Funny. I cannot describe to you exactly the feeling I got when I finally beat Nightmare Mode, because I've never felt anything like it. It was mostly euphoria, but there was also some sadness mixed in. After spending over a week straight on this game, despite all the BS and stress it's put me through, I was actually gonna miss it. Maybe one day I'll be back to beat Nightmare Mode with 4 players or try out the Insanity mod, which supposedly is harder than Nightmare Mode. Regardless though, I was done. And I was free at long last. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more videos like this, like and subscribe so I can make this my full-time job. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the flip side.